like, after too soon because I need to go to college. I don't want to be in a dead end job, and I also want to be su su successful in life. I want to, I want to be like have money, buy a house, have a husband, have I don't know one or two kids. Maybe I don't know. It's just that I want to do all that. I just want to live my life to the fullest. I want to complete everything on my bucket list. I do want to complete everything on my bucket list. I want to go to different countries. I want to just spend my life happy and to the fullest. So I just don't have to die without doing anything I didn't do. And in fact, I'm not really, really scared of dying. I'm really scared of that. I'm just, like, whenever the fact, fact is mentioned, I get scared. I mean, once we talked about how, what would we do without the sun and all that stuff and how, what, and I was shaking for peace sake. I'm about to cry right now because I'm talking about it. It's like a sad subject for me, anyways. Um, anyways, oh god, I have to keep my, oh my god. Anyways, um, as you can see, I'm really easy to make cry. I can cry easily. Uh, it's just really easy to make me cry, I don't know why. Many people say I'm a crybaby, but I don't really care. I mean, it's good to cry. It, I mean, don't be afraid to cry. Guys, don't be afraid to cry. First thing, one, I think you're a man. I seriously think you turn into a man if you cry once in front of a girl or in front of anyone. You are a man. And, um... I cry a lot. I mean, it's really good to cry. I mean, it's really good to release all that out, all, all that stress, and all that sadness in you. So after that, you can be happy the whole time. You can be just happy and forget all your sorrows. That's why I'm like really, really optimistic. I cry. I just cry and. Who cares? I mean, if someone hates me, if I lose a friend, I cry. But then the next day, I don't care. You think I'm sad? No. I'm releasing all my stress. I released all my stress. I don't care. Pass it to the past. Forget about it. Just forget about it. I might get, like, crap. I, get, I might get crap hurt. People say crap to me because I'm so happy the next day. Well, who cares? Forget about what, a, what someone freaking said, what freaking happened, past is past. Forget what happened yesterday, move on to tomorrow. And stop staying in the past. I mean, first thing, sometimes the past isn't really good to stay in or what? We made some extra cheesy macaroni and cheese for dinner. Okay. Well, sometimes. The past isn't really good to be in. Sometimes you, um, it's just, I don't like to stay in the past. I don't like to move in the past. Sometimes the past is a nice place to visit when you're completely older and laugh about all the mistakes you made and all that. But the past is the past. Move on. Move on. Build a bridge and get over it. Build a bridge and get over it. That's what I want to say to all you people who are mad at someone. They're, they have probably cried. They have probably cried. Well, and you're still mad at If you're still mad at them, build a bridge and get over the freaking bridge. I mean, it's going to hurt them much more if you're even madder. And t talk to them. Make sure you talk to them. Don't just ignore them. It's going to make them even sadder. Build a stupid bridge and get over it.
okay? Get over your madness, go on to happiness, because you're just making a person more sad, because you're mad at them. So build a bridge and get over it. Okay? Well, anyways, 